Boy, that cloud back there looks looks like rain, but I checked the radar before I came out and decided to ride, and it was going to be fairly warm today and cloudy and overcast, but no rain. That don't mean it can't rain. It could rain. But, yeah, I'm not feeling great today. I feel like I feel like I've been kicked in the stomach for one thing. YouTube is has finally well I don't I don't even know if it's worthy of talking about, but I'm under a 30 day suspension. I can still upload videos, I can uh, edit videos, I can, you know, talk to people in comments, but um a lot of my features like Super Chat have been cut off. I, I believe I can still stream a live video, but they, they say I'm duplicating. And um, now I know that I've repurposed some of my original works that was done six, seven years ago. I thought that was legal. I thought you could uh, do that video over and add music to it, you know, as long as it's copy for copyright free music and things. But I've made some mistakes here lately, evidently. I've I've had collaborated with people and I've put up their work, so that's a duplication. But there's I had the rights, you know, I mean it was like I was told, yeah. Now do I have a uh, email showing that I did that? No. I got 30 days to get all that documentation together. So if I've made a video and a collaboration with you and you told me, I got to send you an email now telling you that um, I got to get that, I got to get that proof uh, in a, you know, some kind of form that I can show um, YouTube that I did a collaboration with you. Another thing that I've done that's got me in trouble, I can tell, without knowing, because they're not Pacific when they send you something like that for a 30-day suspension. They just have this legal ease language that says duplication. Well, I've been able to find videos that are created comments. And I'm gonna make a video might even do it in this video right here just show you how easy it is and show you that other people have made videos promoting the fact That's that right. Thank you. once you find a video in creative commons you can put it up on your channel and you got the ability to monetize it or the ability to share it but evidently it's it's they look at it as a duplication and especially if you're monetizing it and especially if it's got truth in it or something that's a message in it that they don't want the sleeping masses to hear. So therefore, I've got, in 30 days, I've got to take down a lot of videos that are telling a story or telling a truth about this reality. Now, that's why I got feeling like I got kicked in the stomach is because it's the c-word i've been c-worded and it don't feel good because the way i make videos has got to change people it has got to change it's either got to be my original work or i've got to have written video permission to upload my collaborators works where in the past I haven't I haven't done it I I just took you know the people that I'm working with and collaborating with I just took their word they you know they said use this video to promote me and promote you know you and that's duplicating so that it's got all of it's got to be edited 
Now, some of these videos that are in Creative Commons are being put up by other people that have millions of views, millions of views, and I can tell they're monetized. And some of them are not monetized. But use one video as an example. The one about the giant trees and um, Earth's ancient history about what was, you know, pre-flood. And that Russian guy made the video and a girl did a voiceover. And she put it out to the world for people in the United States to, you know, copy it and put it up, share it. That's what a lot of people do on their works. But it, you, now I've got to go in. That's an hour and 17 minute long video. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go into that video. And now that I've got editing tools, they did leave the editing tools on. I think that's kind of real funny. Yeah. They don't want you just maybe to delete it. They want you to think about maybe editing it. Now, how could you edit a video like that without taking it down to nothing, a nub? In other words, they got to take it down to like 10 or 11 minutes at the most probably and put in the description a link or links, plural, to where they can see the whole video. Now, will that be duplication? I won't know until after 30 days, and then I resubmit, you know, for them reevaluating my whole channel. So, this is day one of the 30 day suspension that has cost me a uh, super chat. If you know what super chat is, you know that I was on the verge of, of using super chat in some of my live streams. And that's where I made another mistake. On some of my live streams, I live streamed what I thought was Creative Commons works. Works that was in the public domain. But the works was heavily telling the truth about this reality. So I've got to reshift and rethink everything about what I'm doing. So my channel over the next 30 days is going to change. A lot of things are going to go away. But my blog page uh, I could put the full version of the video up on the on the blog page from the original website that it comes from, and direct you over there to that. Maybe I'm just not meant to tell people the truth about this reality. You know, you can't go back to sleep, and I've been trying to wake people up. And now it's 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 going to either cost me my channel. They could just literally take my channel away. Over a thousand videos be gone. None of it's backed up. I've got some things backed up, but <laughs> I I'm not good at handling files, if you know what I mean. Folders and files, and so I've duplicated my own own files and own videos so I've had to delete a lot of that and now it's like it's the universe is telling me I've got to do uh, crap cleaner <laughs> to my whole YouTube channel like you do your hard drive that, that's a good funny way to look at it I gotta run crap cleaner <laughs> on my YouTube channel and get rid of all the duplications and all of the all of the stuff that's actually really talking about subjects that I love to you know hear other people talk about and so somehow I've got to come up with a creative way to tell these stories in in buddy style and it ain't easy I've, I've talked about dyslexia and having learning disabilities, but Laura was reminding me that I've never really told the whole story. I've never really made a video that actually shows how I've been so successful over the years to overcome all of these so-called major disabilities. Uh, I was born developmentally delayed and uh, life hadn't been easy but I never let it stop me. I always figured out technology that would su supersede my inability to hear or understand. 
See, that's what Laura was saying. You got to tell people the whole story in a video form without dragging it out too long, she said. <laughs> so, that if I focus on doing the clap crap cleaner to my YouTube channel, I got to get creative and come up with some ways to talk about that subject in particular. Because if YouTube would really talk to me and really like communicate with me, they would see that um, under Americans with Disabilities Act, they're really stepping on my toes really hard and they're really messing with me because of the communication problem. I'm so dyslexic that I'm legally blind and been that way since a doctor diagnosed me when I was 19 years old and pissed the whole state of Mississippi off because he diagnosed me that so I could get reading, reading books for the blind at Library of Congress. I was dyslexic, and, um, but he categorized me as, as legally blind because my dyslexia is that profound when it comes to the actual letters of the written word instead of seeing words, I see pictures. But I gotta tell those stories. I gotta show people that I can overcome anything. I'm gonna overcome this 30 day suspension. And if I'm gonna take my channel down, I'm gonna do it myself. I'm not gonna let uh, this suspension turn into something that they can, next step is they take my channel away. All I can tell them is this, if they were to talk to me one-on-one -on -one person or by a phone or, or video conference call, if they seen my heart and they seen really what I'm trying to do, they would leave me alone. Or they would guide me into what is the, what is the proper video that, that is in public domain, that is in real creative commons. And instead of threatening me, you know, with total <laughs> takedown, so things have changed on the on my YouTube channel as of today, and that's that's why I'm not feeling so great. But I, I made myself take a bike ride. I got 30 days to turn this thing around. All right, stay tuned in <laughs> on my heavily uh, C channel. I got to change things around. Take a look at these clouds. Ain't that ain't that beautiful? Well, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Hit that like button. Share my videos. Thank you.